Hey everybody, it's Ped's Card Collection coming back at you with another video and today we're going to be showcasing my most recent baseball card pickups from the Garfield Card Show. So super excited to get into this. This is going to be a little bit of a shorter video. Uh, I got to the show this past weekend around 12 o'clock and it was kind of a sh uh, shorter show so it ended at 2 o'clock and it was under the gun a bit but was able to pick up some nice rookie cards, prospects and a nice autograph so thought I would share with you guys what I picked up and uh, have some fun with that. I'm going to be attending a much bigger card show this upcoming weekend and uh, plan on getting a ton of stuff. So this is just, you know, our, our warm-up round. This is our batting practice round before the actual game starts. So we're just getting our hacks in the cage, you know, driving the ball the opposite way. And then uh, last round, we're going to start turning on some balls. So like I said, nothing, you know, out outrageous here but uh we did get some nice cards so starting off starting us off we got a prince fielder upper deck rookie card just love that one of the classic designs from when i was collected as a kid so i thought that was a pretty cool card next up we got a first bowman chrome of brandon marsh who's playing pretty well for the angels and the angels just sent joe adele down to the minors so kind of been struggling especially with the strikeouts defensively and hasn't really caught his rhythm so looks like Brandon Marsh is gonna keep getting more reps and he's been doing pretty well so far so nice Brandon Marsh first Bowman Chrome next up we got a first Bowman Chrome refractor AJ Puck who's back and healthy so far this year even though the athletics hands are pretty much on strike as Though they feel like they just dumped pretty much their whole entire team and are giving up. So uh, it's kind of a sad sight to see. Hopefully they can do something to shake things up and uh, right the ship. But always liked AJ Puck, went to the University of Florida and loved him ever since. Next up we got a first Bowman Chrome of Luis Garcia. I don't know why he hasn't been called up yet. Something weird's going on there. But uh, I like Luis Garcia a lot. I liked what I saw last year from him. And, uh, you know, I got this for a couple bucks, so I picked up two of these. And uh, these cards are pretty much all from two dealers, so, you know, I didn't get uh, to walk around and look around too, too much. So once I found a dealer that I thought was had some stuff up my alley, I kind of just spent most of my time sifting through those boxes, sorting through those cards. And uh, so here we go. Next up, we got a Jesus Lazardo. First Bowman Chrome back when he was with the Nationals. So I like that card a lot. He's had more success early on this year and is still still really high in this kid. I liked him ever since he came, got called up. Uh, he's got a super electric arm, fastball, slider, and I think he's working on changeups. So nice first Bowman Chrome with Jesus Lazardo. We got two of those. Next up, had to get some Alec Manoa. This is the Refractor Bowman's Best rookie card. Pretty sharp one there. And we got a Bowman Mojo from the Silver Pack of Alec Manoa. Really nice card there. Next up we have an Ian Anderson. This is a Jersey rookie card. I think this is from Series 1 Tops, if I'm not mistaken. So pretty sharp card there. Honestly, I haven't seen much from this year, so I don't know how he's playing. But I thought this was a cool card to pick up, so... Definitely had to snag that one. Then Garrett Cole, not off to the greatest start this year, but first Bowman Chrome, Garrett Cole, got to love it. Uh, I think Cole definitely bounced back, and uh, the Yankees are playing uh, with their hair on fire, so they got the best record in the league, and hopefully Garrett Cole can you know, uh, start tagging along to that rhythm. So we got a couple more cards to go here, guys, but I do appreciate you watching. Let me know what you think of these pickups in the comments below. And like I said, super excited for next weekend. Here we go. We got the Rookie Rain Prism Rookie Card of Xander Bogarts. Had never seen this card before. Part of the reason why I love going to card shows, you see cards that you didn't even know existed like so. So I picked up two of these bad boys. Xander Bogarts is an absolute beast for the Red Sox. Obviously, these are shortstop. Next up, we picked up this nice Ryan Mountcastle. It's like a gold prism. I think it's a, I don't know what they call it, if it's a gold, like, color. Really sharp looking card, so uh, we'll take that for sure. 
Next up, we got a Manny Machado rookie card. Super underrated in the hobby for whatever reason. But he was turning the cover off the ball yet again last time I checked. So hopefully when they get Tatis back, they can start feeding off each other and bring some life to that team and make a run for October. Then we got a couple nice prospect cards. High on this kid, Cole Wynn. First, Bowman Chrome Speckle Refractor. This one is from 2018. Bowman wasn't numbered this year, but love this card a lot. He's on the brink of the big leagues. And I'm hoping that Mr. Cole Wynn and Jack Leiter can be the two horse of the, uh, the Rangers rotation for a long time to come. So pretty sick card there. Then we picked up two really nice first Bowman Chrome Sapphire cards, one of Max Meyer. He's doing really well. Super high on this kid. I think he went to the University of Minnesota, throws cheddar balls, cheddar biscuits, and uh, disgusting, disgusting sliders, curveball, whatever you want to call it. But he's nasty, so should have picked up two. The guy had two. I only picked up one for some reason, but uh, then we also got one of these Pete Crow Armstrong first Bowman Chrome Sapphires, who's also performing really well. He's back and healthy this year, so it's good to see now with the Chicago Cubs organization. So a really nice card there. Goes well with the Mets blue, unfortunately no longer with us, but I still like this kid a lot. Pulled his first Bowman Chrome Refractor Auto out of the uh, Soul. I, I think I got this. For, yeah, I definitely got this for last, but out of the loan... 2020 Bowman Draft Jumbo Hobby I opened so big fan of his still that card is uh, tucked away and then we got some nice non first but they're Bowman Chrome Prospect cards we got a couple nice ones here I think these cards are underrated undervalued we got the Ronald Acuna Juniors back in the lineup back with the Braves still trying to get his feet underneath him so we got one and two of those I think I had maybe one if if even that but uh, had to pick those up. And then we got some nice Vladimir Guerrero Jr. Bowman Chrome cards. We got one. And we got two of those. And then the last two cards, guys. Like I said, going to be a little bit of a shorter video. We got the Juan Soto 2018 Bowman Chrome Prospect card. Really sharp one there. Had to pick that up. And the biggest card. thought this was a neat card. This is another prospect. This is an Alec Thomas. Leaf perfect game patch auto two of five so pretty sick card there was pumped about that purchase he's in triple a right now for the arizona diamondbacks and they desperately need his bat and his, his and, you know pretty soft and uh, he's been in their system patch auto that's it for tonight's video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Hook me up with a like if you did. And I will catch you all on the next one. Ped's Card Collection out. Take care.